In this video, we are going to discuss the next data type in Python and that is dictionary. Now, dictionary is also a collection type of array in Python, but they have key value pairs. Dictionary is having key value pairs. A dictionary is unordered and it can be changeable. That means it is mutable. We can use the keys to assess the items from a dictionary. That means in this key and value pair, if we want to assess, then in list or in string or in tuples also, we have done with the help of indexes. But in dictionary, if you want to assess any particular item, then how can you do that? You can do that with the help of the key of the key value pair. Now to declare a dictionary, we use curly braces. For declaring any particular dictionary, we use the curly braces. For example, if I have declared a particular dictionary named dict, then dict equals to, in this curly braces, I am going to write the key value pairs. Let's say if you are giving the numeric as key, then one and it is having, let's say the name is Amit, it is separated with commas. Two, let's say the name is Ani. Three, the name is Aman. So this is how you can give the elements or you can change the elements or assess with the help of the key and value pairs. So this is how you can declare a particular dictionary with the help of key value. How can you display this particular dictionary? Simply with the help of print statement. In print, you have to write dict. When you write this, the particular dictionary gets printed that all the key value pairs get printed. Now, if you want to change the value, that if you want to change any particular value, if you want to display only of a particular key, then how can you do that? For example, if I want to display this particular record of Ani, then how can I do? For that, I have to write print dict and in the square brackets, I have to give the key. We know that for using any particular key value pair or for assessing, we use the key in dictionary. So I will write here too, this particular key will help me to assess the item from the dictionary. As I execute this particular statement, it will give in the output ani, that for this particular key, the value is ani. Similarly, you can assess the particular other keys also with the help you can write here one also for Amit or three if you want to fetch for Aman also you can do that. Now you can also use a method also is there if you use this particular method dict dot get and there also you can give the key whichever key you want to give. Like for example you can give the key one here you can use the particular assessing with the help of get method also. This serves the same purpose to assess the values as the particular above statement does. Now, since we are using the key to assess the item, that means it cannot have duplicate value. Another thing added to the dictionary that it cannot have duplicate value. Because it is not possible for a single key to have multiple values or same values, it will declare an error. So it cannot have multiple values and the values can have duplicate items. If there are a number of values which are same, then they can have the duplicate items. But key needs to be same. Key needs to be unique and it cannot be duplicate. Now, how can we do the data manipulation? That means how can we add a new value to the dictionary? For that, we have to simply write here, let's say dict. And firstly, here you're going to mention the key. Let's say if you want to have added till three, okay, so next we'll add for four. And there I want to give value or let's say I want to give a name, Amita. So this is the particular value which will be added to the dictionary and with the help of print, you can see that this particular value is appended at the end of dictionary. You can replace a particular value also and for replacing also what you have to do is, for example, you want to replace this particular value only. Then you have to write date at which particular you are replacing, you have to write, let's say at four, I am replacing and there I want to replace it actually with Sukanya. So I want to replace with this name only, then we can replace the value like this also in dictionary. If I want to delete a particular value, then how can I do that? For example, if I want to delete the key value three, then I have to do is dict dot pop 
and you have to mention here the key that is if you want to delete from three let's say so this is deleted and then you again print the dictionary using this statement print dict then you can see there will be only one two and four which you have just now updated three will be deleted you can use the remove method also that also serves the same purpose for deleting a value from a key and a value pair from the dictionary now it has also the same set of functions and methods which we have studied in list and tuple that is you can use the clear method to clear the dictionary you can use the items method to return the list containing tuple of key and the value pairs you can use update also and you can use this particular values method also this method returns the list of all the values in the dictionary which are there set default returns the value of the specified key if you use this particular method that is set default then this method will return you the value of any particular specified key so this is all about dictionary now let us create a dictionary and process some methods so so that you can get a clear picture of dictionary so firstly let us create a particular dictionary and then we will use certain methods to assess it so we have created a dictionary and we will name the dictionary as dict and we use curly braces to initialize the dictionary and let us now give the key and value pair so for this one let's say this one is a roll number and for one i am giving the name as amit for two i am giving the name as ani and for three i am giving the particular name as amita these are the values which i am giving in dict or the dictionary and next i am going to print this particular dictionary and as i execute this particular set you can see here it has returned me all the values which are there that the key and value value pair which are there in this particular dictionary now if i want to fetch from any one particular item i want to fetch for any one record then how can i do that for example i want to fetch for only second then it is going to return me here you can see that second it has only returned me the name that is ani so you can fetch for a single record also that if you want to fetch for only one key instead of the whole dictionary next if i want to add a particular value how can i do that to this particular dictionary if i want to add the particular value then let me see firstly how can i do that in this particular dictionary at fourth place i want to add a value let's say this is a value and next i am going to print the dictionary so this is how we can do it we have given the key that is the four and the value related to it sukanya and then we are going to print this particular dictionary as i execute this next you can see it the four and the and one more key and the value pair has been added to the dictionary this is how you can add a particular value and similarly what we can do we can replace a value also how can we do that let's see for example let us change it here only at second place i want to change the name instead of ani i want to print the name i want to change the name as anaya so let's see how can we do that also we have removed an entry also so let's see this is how it's done amit and the second place earlier it was ani now it's anaya and at third place it is amita and as i have changed the code so last entry is automatically delete next if i want to delete a particular value this is how we have actually replaced next if i want to delete then i can do deletion with the help of pop method so how can i do that here if i want to delete dict dot pop is the method if we use and next i give here the let's see from second i have want to pop and then i want to print this rest of the dictionary as i execute this particular thing here you can see that now there is only one key and that value is amit at second key the value is amita that means second place this particular value is deleted or it is removed you can use the remove method also it will serve the same purpose next if i want to use the clear method let's see dict dot clear this is the method if i have used and then i am printing the dictionary again you can see here it returns me the empty curly braces that means all the data from the dictionary has been deleted similarly we can use the keys also 
let us see how can we use the keys method like if i want to fetch for the keys then how can i do that if i execute this set then you can see it returns me all the list containing all the keys similarly it goes for items also it returns a list of tuple of keys and value pairs and next if i want to update a particular dictionary that we have seen we can replace it or you can use the update for the dictionary with all the key and value pairs next this is the keys and if i want to fetch for values let's see if there is any change in both the methods there is no change because key automatically returns the list containing all the keys so it automatically returns you the values also and similarly it is the list of the values which has been returned that is the whole dictionary so by the end of this video we have studied about dictionary as a data type in python for other type of data types we will look into upcoming videos